again and welcome back to the channel Richard here again with another unboxing video and today it's a brand new release of Pink Floyd The Dark Side of the Moon 50 years so this is the deluxe box edition uh, which contains a CD LP of the remastered original album the CD LP of The Dark Side of the Moon live at Wembley 1974 it's got a blu-ray of the original album 5.1 and high resolution remastered stereo tracks um, blu-ray of atmos and high resolution remastered stereo mixes a dvd of 5.1 and remastered stereo mixes a 160 page hardback photo book a music book of the original album replicas of the two seven inch singles and memorabilia so let's get this unboxed and see what's inside Okay, so this has arrived today from HMV, uh, that's where I got it delivered from. Um, just taken off the wrapping, so let's have a look. But to start things off, this box is absolutely huge. Um, I've got the original 30th anniversary Super Audio CD uh, of Dark Side of the Moon. And just to show you a size comparison, this is huge. Uh, also got the original Dark Side of the Moon Immersion box set, which is here. And as you can see, it dwarfs that as well. So, just so you can see, it's really big. Okay, so... Let's have a look at the back of this before we start. Okay, I'm going to try and zoom in on this for you. Okay, so this is what the limited edition deluxe box set has, which I said in the intro, but um, you can see here what's going on okay it looks like the 5.1 surround mix is 24 bit 96 kilohertz and the stereo mix is 192 kilohertz Okay, that's the same on the second Blu-ray. Um, not sure what the Dolby Atmos will be, but it won't be 192. Okay, so the two singles is Money, Stroke, Any Colour You Like. And the second one is Us and Them slash Time. So, such a great album. Um, Going to be looking forward to listening to this tonight. I'm going to give the Atmos a mix, uh, uh, a listen to first. Okay, so here's the box set. Um, we take it off and we can see the prism cut out on the front. Okay. Hard quality cardboard, uh, which houses the book. That's why you've got the cutout around the sides. Okay, and then there's another box inside. So, here's the book. Hard bound. And the back. So, quite a lot of pages, as you can see. We'll come back to that. Okay, so the inner box has the prism again, but we have some gold on there. And that's the size of this one. Okay. And then we've got some cutouts. So, on the left, we've got a DVD, 
a Blu-ray and the Atmos Blu-ray. And on the left hand side, we've got the familiar black artwork and we have some white artwork. Okay, let's go with the white artwork first. Okay. So this is the Live at Wembley CD. Uh, we got any goodies in here? Yep, we've got a booklet. So, nice glossy booklet. Got the track listing on the left. Yeah, quite nice. And the CD will be on the left, uh, on the right, sorry. So that is the CD artwork. Okay. Moving on to the original artwork. So this is the album. Okay, have we got anything in here? Yeah. Okay, glossy again. There's the track listing and some information on the right hand side. And we get the lyrics. Yeah, very nice. Uh, let's have a look at the CD. That's the CD artwork. Okay. Uh, let's move on to the DVD. Top left. That's the listing. It's got a 24 bit 48 kilohertz uncompressed stereo mix on this one. It's got a Dolby Digital 640 kilobytes and 448 kilobytes. Region zero and it's in NTSC. Okay, the DVD is in a nice little bag, a little bit smaller than the Laserdisc ones I'm quite familiar with. because it'll play on the mind okay the blu-ray okay so this one as we said 24 bit 96 kilohertz 5.1 uh, then we've got a 24 bit 192 kilohertz stereo mix and then a DTS HD master audio 5.1 surround mix and a HD, uh, DTS HD master audio stereo mix Okay, so again, it's in a little wallet. Okay, just checking the disc, it's a single layer. So it's a 25 gig disc. And finally onto the Atmos. So Dolby Atmos on there, stereo mix, 24-bit, 192 kilohertz, uncompressed, and DTS HD master audio. Okay, and it's a single layer, 25 gig again. So there's a look at the artwork on it.
Okay, so that's the discs. And what we got next? Okay, we've got some replica singles. Okay, so us and them. And time. So there's the vinyl. And that's the seven inch case. And let's have a look at the other one. Next up, we have a very highly glossed booklet. So, it's got a list of the songs there and the interviews, and we're going to get these good shots. So, and we've got the music. Yeah, very nice. Quite a nice book. And then we've got another booklet here. Floyd at the planetarium. So we've got a list in there. Okay. Then we get another Prism shown. Which is another gold box. So a box inside a box inside a box. Really nice. Okay. So now we're on to the vinyls. So just like the CD cases, this will be the light, this will be the album and this will be the live album. So let's have a look at this. So a nice gatefold case for us. So in here we've got posters. Yeah, nice big poster. Quite nice, single sided, and the second one. Spelling out Pink Floyd. That's quite nice. Not seen that before, I don't think. other stuff in here. Pink Floyd and Pink Floyd. OK, 
Okay, and the right side has the vinyl. Um, it was only a one disc, a one record album, this. And there it is. Very nice. And we'll, of course, be giving that a spin as well on the turntable. Okay, and on to the live album. It's quite nice. Smooth velvet feel to the case. Um, a lot of quality gone into this set. Uh, hence the high price tag that it has. Okay, we do have some stuff in here as well. Okay. It's another couple of posters. Nice artwork. And this one as well. So a bit different, got a signature at the bottom, uh, Pink Floyd, October 1974, this is the winter tour, and that's all the venues that they were at, the nearest one to me would have been Liverpool, but I wasn't born yet, so I couldn't go to it. Okay, and finally, let's get the vinyl out. Black again. Again, it's just a single record. Yeah, really nice. So, we've just got the photo book, uh, the big one, to look at now. So, we put everything back as it was. Finals. Okay, and we're on to the big photo book. Okay. So this is the 50th anniversary book and we have a lot of photos in here of the group. Yeah, this is really nice. I'm going to have a good, uh, good read of this. Good flick through. Yeah, really nice. Yeah, really good. Some stuff on the album and the live album. Cover art, alternative artwork. Yeah, be a good read. So, how does it compare to the other set? Um, OK, 
great that fits together quite nicely so the immersion set I did keep the back card always do so this is what you had on this set I'm sure it said what anniversary this one was okay but those were everything that you had inside this set so you had a DVD two DVDs two CDs uh, the blu-ray disc Okay, so the original stereo mix was 24 bit 96 kilohertz on this one. It's now been upgraded to 192 kilohertz. So let's have a quick look. This was the, the Blu ray, which I've listened to many, many times. And then in here, we've got all these goodies. Um, Collectors cards, credits, coasters, more DVDs, CDs. Can't really remember what was in there. Nothing by the look of it. Pink Floyd marbles by the look of it. So photo book in this one. So one part with either of these sets. Um, keep them forever um, that's the rest of the goodies in here so that's a quick look at the version set and um, while I'm at it this was the super audio CD which was dated 2003 um, just listen to this a few times as well um, nice little booklet that went with that as well so we can see the artwork in there so, yeah, I'm a huge uh, Pink Floyd fan. Um, had to get this one when, when it was announced. Uh, really pleased with it. And really looking forward to listening to it tonight. But, again, thanks for watching. Um, please give us a like because it helps the channel out a lot. Please consider subscribing and uh, be good to hear from you in the comments below. If you're a Pink Floyd fan. Um, I know... Pretty sure Michael will be uh, watching this video. Um, but uh, yeah, thanks for watching and I'll see you again soon. Goodbye.